Hello mga CC, welcome back to my channel Ruti and Stitch. Now before we start, please don't forget to subscribe to Ruti and Stitch for those who hasn't subscribed and that like our videos. If you have any questions, any comments or any suggestion, just hit the comment box below. Okay? So today we're going to do a half double crochet and double crochet. This is a continuation of our crochet 101. So we're going to still use the 3 millimeter crochet hook and the 4 ply into fill acrylic yarn. Alright, so let's start. Now we're going to study two stitches today. The first one would be the half double crochet. So for the half double crochet, you have to remember that the, when you're starting the row, you have to start it with chain 1. And then after that, you have to turn your hook to create a loop and then count two stitches from your hook on the second stitch or the second chain from your hook, you just insert your hook and then pull up a loop just like what I'm showing here. So once you're done that, you would have three loop on your hook. Now you get another loop on your hook and you pull it through the three loops. That's how you make your half double crochet. So you just repeat the pattern. Okay, so you turn your hook to create a loop, insert it on your stitch, pull up a loop, and then uh, pull up another loop and insert it on the three loop on your hook. Now just continue doing the same pattern. We're going to do this for two rows. The reason why we're doing this for two rows is so you can actually uh, manage the tension of your thread. Um, pag more na ginagawa mo siya, mas nagiging consistent yung tension ng inyong stitches. Now we are finishing the first row of our half double crochet. So I'm going to show you how to start again. So you chain one, turn, and then make sure you stitch on the first um, uh, stitch of your row. So just repeat the same pattern. This is where you um, apply the practice makes perfect. So if you have a lot of practice, then the, the tension of your thread will be more uniform or the uh, tension of your stitches will be more uniform.
Now we're done with our half double crochet. So we're going to proceed with the second stitch that we're going to um, uh, do today. So this would be the double crochet. So it's similar with the half double crochet. So the difference is it is much higher. So instead of starting your row with one chain, you have to start it with two chains. And then you turn again your hook to create that loop. Now you start your stitch on the third chain from your hook this time. So you have uh, three loops on your hook. Now you pull up a loop and pull it through on the first two. You pull up another loop and you pull it through the last two uh, loop on your hook. So it's very similar with the half double crochet. So I'll show you again. So you turn your hook, insert your hook on the stitch, pull up a loop. You would have three loops. Pull up a loop, pull it through on the first two, pull up another loop, and pull it through on the last two stitches, or the last two loops. So again, we're going to do this on um, uh, your stitches. Uh, uh, for the double crochet, we're going to do it for two rows. Now we just uh, finish the first row of our double crochet. So to start the second row, you have to chain two, turn, and then pull up a loop, insert your hook on your stitch. Pull up another loop. Pull up a loop. Pull it through on the first two and then pull up another loop and pull it through on the last two stitches. So you just have to continue repeating this. And uh, your tension will be more, uh, more um, uniform, consistent if you have more practice. Now since you already know how to make a half double crochet and double crochet, you can already make your own project. Okay, you can uh, make um, like uh, cell phone cases or pouch using a uh, half double crochet and double crochet. You can uh, even uh, uh, use uh, these stitches use uh, uh, to make uh, some complicated, more complicated project like example shorts okay, and bikini top. Okay, you can actually check our other videos and this is mostly what I'm using with my uh, projects.
there you go we're finished with our two stitches the half double crochet and the double crochet so this one the, the smaller one would be the two rows of half double crochet and then the one at the top would be the double crochet so i hope you like our um, crochet 101 part 2 and uh, please please don't forget to subscribe to Ruby and Stitch and check our other videos I hope you enjoy them as well okay we have some uh, other project there bikini tops amigurumi okay and uh, we'll be doing a lot more projects in the future so again please don't forget to subscribe to Ruby and Stitch like our videos and if you have any questions, any requests, any recommendation, just hit the comment box below, okay? Thank you!